asking you shall receive the follow-up to my bell video this is the Morbark wolverine i found it to be another one that doesn't really have a lot of specifics all over the internet just to go and pull up so i had to spend the day looking for stuff because i'm not familiar with this one and no one in my family is but i know they were widely popular so what i ended up doing was looking through a lot of listings of ones actively for sale since these seem to be still in pretty wide use in areas where they're doing a lot of thinning it seems to be a machine of many options i found that they had at least three different engine combinations the cummins the john deere and the perkins all powered this machine and i also found that the options for the heads were just as numerous with a shear head an 18 inch coring saw head with teeth like the modern feller buncher heads just on a smaller scale and bar heads like the one on the bell more or less these machines could bunch unlike the bell the tires i found on the machines for sale ranged from 23.1 by 26s to 30.5 by 32s so also again a lot of options all of the ones i found seem to be made from the early to mid 90s and they're still selling from anywhere from 15 to 30 grand each too so they hold their value the later models featured bunching controls ergonomic operator stations and heat and cooled closed cabs so i could overall would say this would probably be the more viable option over the bell if i had to pick I'm sure my dad would feel the same way a lot of the reviews i read showed that it was still mainly a lot on the operator some just could never get used to it could never get a feel for it but lots did and when they did they're highly productive and for a lot of smaller thinning operations this would really be the way to go fuel efficient cost effective very productive could lay down some timber hmm i could see this keeping a lot of smaller business alive definitely gets a thumbs up from me i'd like the chance to try to run one a favorite piece of equipment you'd like me to dig into a little bit drop a comment and if you don't already, give me a follow. If you watched this far, you should have already hit the like. 